And I was one of those people that was encouraging Mao Sampa. Mao Sampa, take back PF Kulibalungu. Mao Sampa, take back PF Kulibalungu. But because of the selfishness of Mao Sampa, instead of doing the right thing to take back PF Kulibalungu, Avika Polupia. Avika Polupia. Wanting to get something. Eh? Nantua nika ni wako uja timpundu. Eh? Uja mpundu uja. Nalaku shansha lumbule first name yove. But I just, just want to tell you. You went kuri Edgar Lungu so that you people should know. You people should know. There was Mao Sampa wanted money out of the situation. Mao Sampa na kwa tengo ngole kuma lawyers because he thought UPND would pay my lawyers. Mao Sampa did not pay my lawyers. And na kwa tengo ngole right now. Inko ngole shiriumu. Shiriumu kuma legal fees. And he's looking for somebody to, to, to pay. And when he was going back kuliba PF, part of his demands was that ama legal fees are paid na tumbi na tumbi na tumbi na tumbi. So the issue of money came in play. The issue of money came in play. Unfortunately, that move that he made, nama pictures yelewa kupena walungu, when he did that, haka inde ichine was upset. And they got PF now wapela chavinga. Apano mba PF, ili mumino ya kwa chavinga. And mao sampa tapali ichakwe. Mao sampa tapali ichakwe. Tapali ichakwe. PF na wapena nomba chavinga. And I'm, as I'm talking, many of you, you don't even know how Chavinga looks like. But that is a person that Vaaka in the HNM, Vapele, is a useful idiot that Vaaka in the HNM has given PF. And Mao Sampa, Tapali Chakwe. And people told you, Mao Sampa, people told you that Mao Sampa denounced the nonsense that you did. If what you did was illegal. Denounce it. You refused. But you are nowhere, Mao Sampa, now. You are nowhere. And once they have finished dealing with everything, they will come for you. They will come for you. They will come for you, Mao Sampa. Instead of doing the right thing, you put selfishness, Kuntanj. You put selfishness, Kuntanj. He is selfishness, Mwatimo. Eide, Terokova, Tube, Apa, we are. On the part of Valungu, I really wish he had... Watch the entire video, my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. But I do understand, I do understand that you know, for example, I, I, I will talk about Ed Galungu. Ed Galungu has really suffered, um, has really suffered blows, serious blows. Ed Galungu has serious, has suffered a lot of blows. And I want to discuss this openly with you Zambian people so that we know, you know where we are. I want to discuss this with you Zambians. Ed Galungu is not winning at the moment. He's not. I'm sorry to say that. He's not winning at the moment. Haka Inde Hishirema has fixed Edgar Chagwalungu. He has fixed Edgar Chagwalungu. He has really fixed Edgar Chagwalungu. Nawa Muma. They have really fixed him. He's in the corner right now. He's in the corner. He's in the corner. I don't know where, what is remaining of Edgar Lungu. When you talk about Edgar Lungu as a politician, I don't know where Edgar Lungu is. This Haka in the Ichirema has really messed Edgar Lungu badly. He has really messed him up. And uh, I want to tell you, boldly so, I want to tell you, boldly, 
that some of the some of the things which are happening are as a result of Edgar Lungu's attitude. Some of the things I want to I want to be very honest. Eh? I want to be very honest. So some of the things that have happened, why Edgar Lungu is right in the on the ropes. I am still supporting Edgar Lungu. By the way, I'm still supporting Edgar Lungu. I'm still standing with, uh, with Edgar Lungu. But I want to be honest so that, you know, we, sh we can look at things as they are. Edgar Lungu is on the ropes. Akainde Ichirema is really winning because my politics are, my politics is really winning against Edgar Chagwalungu. And is, I'm afraid to say that some of the things that are happening is as a result of the attitude of Edgar Chagwalungu, some of these things. For example, we have PF. PF is gone. That is a fact. PF is gone. PF is gone and Edgar Lungu, we cannot be pretending to say Edgar Lungu will contest on a PF ticket. It will not happen. It will not happen unless I don't know what miracle will fall down. Yes, miracles happen, but really, we don't see Edgar Lungu contesting on a PF ticket. It's very difficult. It's very difficult. And where, where, how did we come, how did we reach where we were? There was a time when I used to say, Edgar Lungu, step up. Step up and take the lead of PF. He hesitated. He hesitated. I was talking, EPF, 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 Edgar Lungu, come in, come in, hey, come in, come in, hey, come in, come in. Take your position. He didn't do it. What happened? We had Mao Sampa with his selfishness. Mao Sampa with his selfishness, with his arrogance and everything, he took over PF. He took over PF. And Mao Sampa thought he was going to be a darling of you, of, of Haka in the HDM. He thought he was going to be worshipped by Haka in the HDM. But Haka in the HDM only uses people. And, and as I'm saying this, I want even those of you who are running away from PF going to Haka in the HDM, I want you to know this. That Haka in the HDM is only there to show you off to the people, to use you. But tomorrow, he goes to another person. Haka in the HDM is like that. Uriyomu haume uriyama ule. Uriyomu haume uriyama ule. Leronga liye ule di taka wekeleko. Ni next. A humanizer. That is Haka in the HDM. He's a political humanizer. He's a political humanizer. Kula miriafie. Uyuaria. Mairuabula umbi. Mairuabula umbi. Eh? Leroba winter kabimba. Ba winter kabimba. Ba diwa important one day. Eh, winter kabimba. Winter kabimba. Winter kabimba. Leroba difisa wa winter kabimba. Pact. Ayabula kubambi. Anyway, let me get back to Mao Samba. Mao Samba. Mao Samba, he was, he was used. He was used to take over PF. He was used to take over PF. And people want to create a situation. There is this propaganda. Even some of these to my bloggers, they keep saying, hey, PF, they are rangos. Hey, PF, they are rangos. There are no rangos in PF. If you really talk about PF and the members, there are no rangos. It is only Haka Inde Ichirema who has created problems for, for PF. And he created these problems because the Edgar Lungu, was hesitating. He didn't step up to take up his position in time. Whatever reasons he had, where, where, where is he now? So Mao Sampa took over. After Mao Sampa took over PF, he didn't get what he was expecting. Mao Sampa did not get what he was expecting. Mao Sampa thought, you know, Bala Musunga will win of you, but he was just used like a bitch. He was just used like a bitch. Mao Samba. After Muna Chibamu like a bitch, he went back to the PF. Of course, they were talking. And let me not just reduce that. They were talking. There were people that were talking to Mao Samba. And I knew about all the discussions that were going on. And I was one of those people that was encouraging Mao Samba. Mao Samba, take back PF Kulibalungu. Mao Samba, take back PF Kulibalungu. But because of the selfishness of Mao Sampa, instead of doing the right thing to take back PF Kulibalungu, 
avika polu pia. Avika polu pia. Wanting to get something. Eh? Na ntua nika na wako uja timpundu. Eh? Uja mpundu uja. Na laku shansha lumbule first name yore. But I just, just want to tell you. You went kuri Edgar Lungu so that you people should know. You people should know. There was Mao Sampa wanted money out of the situation. Mao Sampa na kwa tengo ngole kuma lawyers because he thought UPND would pay ama lawyers. Mao Sampa did not pay ama lawyers. And na kwa tengo ngole right now. Inko ngole shiri umu. Shiri umu kuma legal fees. And he's looking for somebody to, to, to pay. And when he was going back kuliba PF, part of his demands was that ama legal fees are paid na tumbi na tumbi na tumbi na tumbi. So the issue of money came in play. The issue of money came in play. Unfortunately, that move that he made, nama picture zelewa kupena walungu, when he did that, haka inde ichine was upset. And they got PF now wapela chavinga. Apano mba PF ilimumino ya kwa chavinga. And mao sampata pali ichakwe. Mao sampata pali ichakwe. Tapali ichakwe. PF na wapena nomba chavinga. And I'm, as I'm talking, many of you, negation yore mule di mfuapo. You don't even know how chavinga looks like. But that is the person that waka inde ichine ma wapele. Is a useful idiot that waka inde ichine ma has given PF. And Mao Sampa tapali chakwe. And people told you Mao Sampa. People told you that Mao Sampa denounced the nonsense that you did. If what you did was illegal. Denounce it. You refused. But you are nowhere Mao Sampa now. You are nowhere. And once they have finished dealing with everything, they will come for you. They will come for you. They will come for you Mao Sampa. Instead of doing the right thing, you put selfishness kuntanshi. You put selfishness kuntanshi. Is selfishness mwatimo eile teroko wa tuwe apa where we are. On the part of Valungu, I really wish he had done more in negotiating to salvage PF. I wish he had done more. I will not say more. I will not say more. On that, but basically all I can say is that I wish he had done more. I do understand the issue of resources. The issue of resources is a big issue. The issues of the issue of resources is a big issue. Some of these problems that we are facing, the situation which in which Edgar Lungu is now, it is the issue of resources. A lot of you are frustrated, including me, I'm frustrated. But Mostly, it is the issue of resources. And I'm saying this so that you can understand. I, so that we can understand that Kuntanj, we need to find a solution because we need to find a solution. But we cannot find a solution if we don't look at the problems. So now to land, the first thing is that problem faced Valungu did not step up. Secondly, selfishness of Mao Samba. Thinking that by PF, by UPND, by Lamsunga, by UPND, he goes back to Kuli Valungu. Kuli Valungu nako. I mean, kwa issues of resources, alifu akalupia. Akalupia tapaji. Valungu, a lot of you think that, no, eh, even when I'm here, you think that, no, Ed Kalungu is giving him money. Ed Kalungu is sponsoring him. Valungu is not in a position to sponsor anyone. Valungu is not in a position to sponsor anyone. And even some of the problems that he, you are seeing, some of the frustration that you have, is as a result of, you know, the financial position of Valungu. And I'm, I'm, I hope I'm not embarrassing him. But I want you to understand, I want you to know where we are. Valungu Taoke Tamari sources. A lot of you have been coming to me to say, hey, but I to hey, we can do this, we can do this, we can do this. We can do this. And some of you have spoken to you privately to say, sorry, we can't do that because there are no resources. Because there are no resources. And indeed, there are no resources. Because some of you, you think that Valungu Vali Kwaten Pia. Vali Kwaten, it is Saka Yanda Lama. Esho ba po wa foko tarashama dollars wale pera. Takuli iva, nende miva. Valungu Tawakwe Tempia. 
Tawa kwe tempia. And tawa kwe tempia. Chinch tawa kwa tempia walungu. Number one, chakwe wati. Those things that li, haka inda ichi lema used to say kwe wati. Walungu is corrupt. Walungu is corrupt. Walungu, I can assure you, was not corrupt. Was not as corrupt as Ed, uh, UPND and Ed, uh, haka inda ichi lema uh, told you. It is not true. And I know some of these things they were accusing Ed Galungu. Hey, apa, alekula mo. Hey, shani, shani, kutanzania, kuisa, kuisa. People were saying all those things. Ine, 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 ine. Nisha mifise no kumifisa. And um, I hope uh, Ed Galungu will not mind me saying this. Ine wa lungu. He respects me. And he appreciates me because I am the agent, I am the, the chief whatever propaganda or, 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 or uh, campaigner of Alewele Rapo. And if indeed Valungu had resources, Valungu would not have failed to give me those resources. I'm telling you. I, I am very convinced if Valungu had resources, Valungu would not have failed to give me those resources. And those of you who think that, I mean, I have resources... You don't, you know nothing. You know nothing. Me, I'm struggling. My children are, str are struggling. Kuma skuru. Nawa kwa tini kwa tenko ngole. Kuma skuru. Tini kwa tenko ngole. Kuma skuru. And the, the management of some of the schools where my children are, they will bear me witness. Nini kwa tenko ngole. Kuma skuru. Yava nabandi. Why would I have nini kwa ngole kuma skuru kuma nabandi? If balungu nawa kwa tempia. Yeah? I have got serious challenges, financial challenges. I I sold my cartoon. I've been selling things. Why would I sell my things? Why would I sell my things? Made you want to nale uwalem bombela. Made you want to uwalem bombela Muzambia. Ishira muforesha. Ishira muforesha. Ishira muforesha. This is a fact. Why would I have? Why would I? Why would I be having in Congo the kuli made one day? If I have money, why would I? Why? There are no resources, because Ed Galungu did not steal as much as they tell you. Even now, they are busy trying to paint, to paint Ed Galungu as Kawalala. Why be there? Hey, I want to show you the fifteen flat C. Hey, shana shana shana. Hey, Dali Soko. Hey, Tasiroko. Hey, Shantieso. Lungu takwe tempia. Lungu takwe tempia. Nechi takwa ti tempia. Tapali tempia. That is a fact. Tale fola. Tawale fola. Tawale fola. Kodi tawale. Tawale fola. We shana nikani chile. Tawale fola. No baba lungu. Tawale fola. Am I investment? Shiramulanda chio. Bali pere dari so. Shana, 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 shana. That was Lungu's investment. That was Lungu's investment. That was Lungu's plan. Nga nafuma pali wukateka. Umwa na wandiaka lansunga. Because you'll be running ama companies. Ama companies yonze haka inde ichile mali poka. Ama property zari poka. So, Lungu shara fuma kuise mpia. Takuli mpia. Tawakwe tempia wa Lungu. And this has affected a number of political activities. Political activities are run with money. Did you ever understand that? Kuma kote abantu wa keme, abantu wa keme, abantu wa keme. Abantu tabe mafie. Abantu tabe mafie. Ili abantu wa ima, there must be somebody with some resources. For people to come from Mutendere to come to high court, ni mpia ilefu waikwa. They need to have transport. And somebody has to pay for that transport. So for Balungu to gather a crowd, Mulakista wonder, you people, you wonder to say, how come, how come, kuri edi Galungu, kuri edi Galungu takuwa avantu, kuri eche chikwaleva avantu? Because there are no resources. Ndevo kumyewe chishinganelo. There are no resources. There are no resources. If there were resources, you think edi Galungu would not want people to come and escort him. There are no resources. And some of you, you are party officials. Oko muikala, mulalanda, nukulanda. But finish me, chitika. Why can't they touch the You are willing. There are a lot of people that are willing. But to mobilize people and to put up, you know, those political activities, you need resources. 
And those resources are not there. Starting with Rungu himself. The situation at which we are, just that, um, of course, as a former president, Katapa, but the situation in which Mamdala Badabadi, he would be eating Katapa no mule, no mule mbwe, as we are talking. As we are talking. There are no resources. So this is a big issue that I want you people to know that sometimes don't just be frustrated thinking that, no, eh, 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 you know, there is inertia, people are not doing this, are not doing this. There are no resources. There are no resources. If we had resources, even me, as Chirifatari in Demiva, if I had resources, I would put up a fight against Haka in the Ichirema that he would be shocked. He would not be in the state house. If I had resources, Haka in the Ichirema would not be in the state house. But because I don't have resources, that's why some of these things are happening. So I want to tell you, those of you who may feel frustrated like I am, that one of the big issues is the issue of resources. We don't have resources. We don't have resources. And we don't have resources because Haka Inde Ichirema has made sure that there are no resources. He has made sure that there are no resources. He has made sure there are no resources. There are people. Look at it. I'm a businessman. I'm a businessman. Muzambia, those who are making money, banani, banani, they are not making money now. Because Haka Inde Ichirema is not paying them. He has made sure he has frozen their accounts and is not paying them for whatever money that they could have uh, worked for. Because he's, he doesn't want money to go to Ed Galungu. He doesn't want money to go to Ed Galungu. He doesn't want money to go to PF. When you look at the PF uh, senior members, Avena Kampio, Ngova, Nani, Nani, won't say they are frozen to my assets. Joe Malangi, those were the big sponsors of PF. Won't say what they have, you know. So they don't have resources. So this is one of the issues. And I want you people to know that we have got this problem. We have got this problem. Of course, there are certain things that we could have done to take advantage of the situation and whatever, whatever. But unfortunately, most of these things require money. Most of these things require money. So, at the moment, we are only hoping that, you know, the court process goes well on the 10th of November, on the 10th of December. We hope that that process can go well. But we... We are highly doubt, doubtful, doubtful because of Waka in the HDM. Because I'm a judges, as you saw, I'm a judges, but I'm a Shereko Romba, Niba Zambezi. Now to Kwata Waka Pokola was Zambezi, judiciary was Zambezi. Everything is Zambezi number. So it is very difficult. What will come out of the concord, only God knows. So with this kind of situation, what do we do, Nomba? What do we do, Bane? What do we do with this kind of situation? Don't despair. I'm, I'm just giving you, I've given you the scenario in which we are living. I'm giving you the scenario. I've given you the scenario. But what do we do? Are we going to continue suffering? Like this. Whilst the, the people that are supposed to be our leaders are paying, uh, are paying homage to Haka in the HDMA. In I'm standing with you, Zambians. And even Ed Galungu is standing with you. Ed Galungu is standing with you. Don't listen to him. He wants to come and save his family and whatever, whatever. No. Ed Galungu is with you. Mundubile is with you. I have seen Utuma busy, shan shan, people making Utuma comments, whatever. Hey, Mundubire, Mundubire is with you. I support Mundubire because Mundubire, I know, is a credible man. He's a credible man. He's a credible man. So, what we have to do, first of all, what I want to tell you is that, as Zambians, let us, let us, let us separate among the leaders that we have. If you saw Sofia leaders, Tufibi Koko, Ama leaders venebe ne tuba vi koko. Ababe nanankani, ifi fi so so fi rea kuri yaka inde ichirema. Fi rea keni fi rea. 
Fire Kenny Fire. Let all these stupid idiots who are going to work in the let them go. It is actually good. You know, you 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 come to know through friends when you are when you are going through difficulties. Right now, Zambia is going through difficulties. You people are going through difficulties. This is a time that you are going to know who is truly your leader. This is the time that you are going to know who is truly your leader. This time is good because this time is showing us who are true leaders who care for you people. This time that we are going through, this difficult time that we are going through, it's a good time because it is showing us the true characters of these leaders. This is where he belongs. He is not a man of the people. Nikandire. Nikandire. Ilio sa ilio Edgar Lungu alimu state house. Ale mpepa Edgar Lungu. No mba pantu talimu na nika ni mpawa. Tako ite noru pia. Aya kuli haka imbe ichilemu. Na tumbi na tumbi utu. Bon sawa. Vengi sana. Vengi sana. Eh? Vengi. Uh, isha kume muku balumbula. Batina mugeshiba. Vengi. Aba bon sawa. Na vayoku. Veshive ni makrem. Know who they are. There is no any good leader that can go and decide with Haka in the HDMI today. Considering what is currently going on. But me, I have, have put myself number one. Me, I'm with you. I'm going to stand with you. Ed Galungu is going through a lot of challenges. But he's standing with the people. Mundumide is standing with the people. Given Luminda is standing with the people. Nakachinda is standing with the people. Mutoto Kafuaya is standing with the people. Kampiongo is standing with the people. GBM Nangwari Muchifungo is standing with you. He's standing with you. No, the true leaders. Mwe Shibat Avaima leaders have. And once you do that, you have to, don't expect much from these people because they don't have. Don't expect much from Ed Galungu because he doesn't have. That is just a fact. So this fight now is for us Zambians. It's for us Zambians. Let us wait. Let us wait. Let us wait and let us look for an opportunity to fight back. Power belongs to you Zambians. Power belongs to you, Zambians. Power belongs to the, each one of you. I know at the moment, you may not have the political structure on which you can rise. I know at the moment, you may not have somebody that can organize you. But you have to just be patient. Be patient. It is just a matter of time. There will come an opportunity where we will rise. An opportunity is coming soon where we will be able to rise, rise and make Haka in the HDMI fall. This is a fact. This is a fact. This is where we are. This is how broken we are. We are really broken. UPN, uh, PF is really ransacked. There are other oppositions. You can look at Bafred Membe, for example. You can look at and if you have a fishing come but Fred member, yes, socialists are doing very well. Congratulations. You are the convention and the leaders that were chosen. Congratulations to all of you. Vamu Sumari, congratulations, and all you the leaders that were chosen. But I have this news for you. I have this news for you. I want you to know where we are. We have to do a stock take at sort, eh? a stock take of what we have. What do we have? Yes, Bamulero Shakuri Fred Membe. Fred Membe is also in problems. Fred Membe is in problems. I am sorry, I, I don't know how I can put it, but Fred Membe is in problems. Problem, Fred Membe has got court cases. And how kind of each member is not going to let go of a Fred Membe. So, by, 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 by socialist and all of you who are looking to Fred Membe. You should start preparing yourself for a situation where Fred Membe is, is, is jailed. This is, 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 is there. This is there. So we have our own selves. We need to start preparing ourselves 
to fight against Saka in the Ichirema. Away from the courts. Because Mwayakuma court kuri abantu bako haka in the Ichirema. Mwayaku ECZ haka in the Ichirema. Mwayaku parliament haka in the Ichirema. Ama ministers haka in the Ichirema. Everything is haka in the Ichirema. Everything is haka in the Ichirema. And so, for everyone to know, but we should never lose hope. Because we have the powers. The power lies in each one of you. The over 20 million people, that is where the power is. The power is not in Wakapokola. Because even the few police officers, there are only a few police officers in Nefokumyeba. Only a few police officers. And even if they were all police officers who were with Haka in the Ichirema, they cannot beat the 20 million Zambian people. They can't. But judiciary, Kutiba Tuanga, they can even dare to declare Edgar Lungu not legible. They can do that. But they have to know that they have got the 20 million people to face in just a matter of time. In just a matter of time, tonight in the Fokumiwokovet, don't be discouraged. There will come a time when the 20 million people, the power of the 20 million people, will be seen. Don't feel so downcast to say, Nafi Panamata Pali Tapali. In Shitai Kafika, there will come a time when you'll be able to push back. There will come a time. I want to remind you where we are coming from. That we had that time in 1989. 1989, Zambians stood. Zambians stood. The majority Zambians, they were not organized by whoever, whoever. Uh -uh. A time came. 1989. 1989, 1980. Bakaunda had to give up and go for an early election. In 1991. That time, like it happened then, will come. Even before independence, we had a similar situation. 1962, 63, some of you, you may not follow the history, but 19, 1961 to 1963, the power of the people came up. And it pushed our Sungu to give up, to say, no, we can't go on. And that's how they gave up independence. That's how they gave up and gave independence to Zambia. Because there was pressure, strong pressure. But when 1961 came, 1961-1962, 63-63, we can't handle it. Same with Muriba Kaunda. It happened. It started 1998, 1999. Fiakaba. Bakaunda had to give up. Bakaunda had to give up. Bahaka in the He can be feeling so powerful and everything. I can tell you the power that you people have is, is power that Bahaka in the cannot fight. Yes, he can defeat Edgar Lungu. They can do whatever they want. They can do it. And we can feel very disappointed. But the power that we have as Zambians is nothing compared to the power that Waka in the HDMI have. And I'm telling you, time is coming when you'll be excited. It will be like a trumpet that will blow. A trumpet will blow. And when the trumpet will blow, everyone will come out of their homes. They will not need transport. They will not need transport. They will not fear the police. Because even the police will be on their side. That time, that's what I'm waiting for. My message tonight is that Lolele ni penga. Lolele ni penga. Whatever they are going to do. Lolele ni penga, diala adira no mbaline. I penga, diala adira no mbaline. The trumpet will blast for the children of Israel to get liberated. And you will be liberated. 
for the children of Zambia to be liberated, and you will be liberated. I am going to wait for that time. I'm not going to, to beg Haka in the HNM. I'm not going to go down on my knees on Haka in the HNM. I am waiting for the trumpet. The trumpet will blast very soon. Do whatever you want to Edgar Lungu. Deny him to say he's not going to contest. The trumpet will blast. It is just a matter of time. The trumpet will blast. Haka in the HMA thinks he has it. And some fools are joining him. Some traditional leaders are praising him. Some church leaders are praising him. The trumpet will blast. Very soon. Very soon. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.